Hey everyone, welcome back to Dinkum. Sorry, my voice kind of cracked right there. What? So sorry. Hey, how you guys doing today? Welcome back to my little town of uh, Harmony. Um, yeah, we are so basic here. I am so used to having all the other stuff done. <laughs> And now I'm just kind of like back to the old drawing board, right? It is what it is. Um, we got clover today. Clover. Clover or half a heart. Oh, I don't want to order from the catalog. I'm so sorry. That was totally my bad. Could you give me something nice to do? I do have a logging license. Four gumwood planks? Okay. Four gum one planks, we can do that. We can do that. Clover usually hates me and gives me the worst things to do. If you've watched my other live streams from my other island, you will know how much she hates me. We want Clover here as soon as possible. So, four gum planks. Plank. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we can do that. We got it. We got it. Yeah, it's just. I, I find it challenging yet sometimes frustrating to start over like it's it's fun to have the challenge it's the grind and the constant um, getting materials and you know I can it kind of gets to me after a while now when you get your island built up and, and your skills built up, it becomes a little bit better. <laughs> Thank you. I will take that. I will gladly take the money. Oh, we got a white baseball cap. That would be cute. Got up to three fourths hearts, you guys. Maybe if we buy some more stuff. Cargo pants, just what I wanted. Okay, so we bought everything in the shop. Yeah, she's three fourths heart. So, um, There's not much else you can do at this point when you've done her request and you've bought all the stuff. But even doing that to that much today, I feel like we're really close to guys with her. Like it's not gonna be, it's not gonna take forever now to get her in. Um, I feel like we're really close. Let's just, we're just gonna sell some of this stuff. <clears throat> I do want the white baseball cap, though. Probably not near what we paid for everything. This is what, 34000 Yeah, I don't, I want to get my money up first, I think, because um, I need to see how much our debt is. Are we in debt? Yeah, lots. Yeah, I'm gonna hold off to get some more money built up. Yeah, we're lots. <laughs> we are lots, so yeah. We're gonna go over to where we've started our town. Our bandstand is built, yay. Yep, our bandstand is built, so we need to decorate around it and everything, but yay, I think this is a perfect place. Um, we've got Franklin, or not Franklin, we've got Theodore's Museum over there. We're getting there, you guys. We've already got some places lined up for people to move into, so <clears throat> I think we built the mine also. Maybe we should get a mine pass. However, I don't think my hunting is up to par yet. We may have to go hunt. Um... Yeah, I'd rather spend twenty-five thousand for this. And um, we are gonna be horrible in the mind, guys. I'm just saying. Um, yeah, that's cute. 
Um, what about, uh, I don't have a helmet, but I can get a torch. No, I think I'll wait. I think I'll wait. Um, maybe we need to check licenses and see where we're at with, <clears throat> excuse me, see where we're at with stuff. Mining. Oh, we just need a little bit more to get a better, um, hunting license. So let's do that. Let's see what other... Uh, what are our dailies? Craft a new tool? Travel 500 miles by vehicle. Well, we do have a rowboat. Craft a new tool. We'll see if we can do that. Y'all mind? The wildlife around here is just crazy. We need gum. Okay, we need a 10 bar. That's all we need. Um... Okay, we should have enough just with that to be able to go get better. Um, and our pickaxe is up to copper. It'd be better if it was up to silver, but that's going to take a while. Yeah, then we can go ahead and get the copper spear. spear. Um, that's going to be better than what we've got now. So, um, that'll be a little bit better for the mines. We may have to take a bunch, we may have to get a bunch of mangrove sticks and take a bunch of lights. We, we are inadequate <laughs> to do really anything. So, I'm just looking at the doggos around. Because we have so many dens close by, you just never know. You know, you don't know. Um, yeah, copper. Why did I do a copper axe? Palm wood plank. Okay. Why did I do a copper axe? Um, palm wood plank. Palm wood plank. Ay. We're going to make a couple of them. And then I think we need to go get another. I don't think I have another pickaxe, do I? No. Maybe we need to go get another pickaxe as well. <clears throat> because um, yeah, we don't have the jackhammer or anything yet. We don't have anything fun and fancy yet. So... If we're gonna go to the mines, maybe tomorrow, if we can get ourselves situated here, then yeah, we need to be a little bit more prepared. Cause we're gonna go through pickaxe probably quickly. Now I'm wondering if I should buy the torch. Um, it's only 6000 That's not bad. It's not going to leave me with much money. No. We're going to do the mangrove stick thing, I think, because um, it's cheaper. <laughs> <clears throat> we may just have to go get a bunch more um, mangrove sticks. I mean, that is what it is right now. So, yeah, we might suck up a little bit in the mines when we first go down because, yeah. Um, pickaxe, what do you need? Oh, we need another copper bar. We are out of copper. Okay, so we need copper. Oh, I was going to look up mangrove. Um, we have four mangrove. We have four mangrove. So, we need to get mangroves and we need to get, um, some more copper. Oh. More meat's good. I'm good with more meat. Um, oh, it's just crazy that I don't have, um, I don't have a glider. I'm hoping that something will find down in the mines. Are you still following me seriously? Quit following me. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, now dogs are going after it. We could just kind of sit here and watch, watch and see what happens. They got him. Good job, doggos. Good job, doggos. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. I was like, we got some good big drumsticks? Yeah. One thing about having a new island and even more so having more than one island is knowing your layout because I get them confused so easily. <clears throat> Which island am I on? Where are the mangroves? Um, and I see them over here. We need to get our axe down. Um, I just made another one. Did I not have one before? Oh, it's right there. I think the hardest part about some uh, starting over is the grind at the beginning. Like I said, before your level gets up on your skill levels, it's just, it can be taxing, you know? Can I get that? I can't. I did it. And the nice thing about the mangrove sticks is you can make a lot of them very quickly. Um, who's after me? And where? Um, I hear them, but I do not see them. I don't know. I don't know what's coming after me. Um, yeah, okay. Whatever that was could not get to me, I guess. How many have we gotten? 29? You gotta go way up there. <laughs> why? Why? Why you gotta go way up there? And if you can get the smaller ones that are kind of already broken, they you they don't take as much energy or axe um, to get these. So that's why I like to get those kind of first. I need to like figure out where I'm at. Oh, I don't want to go that way. <laughs> that's what's trying to get me. Oh. Give me all my sticks. They worked hard for those. <laughs> I worked hard for those. I kind of wanted to, didn't I need to find more copper too? Guess we can kind of look as we go back. 
Are we close to the desert area? I don't even know. You just never know when you might where you might find ore though. Yeah, see, I'm already using some of my pickaxe, which I don't really want to do right now because we need it for the mine. Let's see how much copper ore we have. Four. Really? Four. Now we have, what, five, seven? Yeah, so it can be a little taxing and it can be a little exhausting. <laughs> but you have to do what you have to do. Right? There's more mango over there. Um, we almost have enough or two. Still not quite enough. Just get a few more. Oh, here's some copper right over here. We're going to end up using our whole pickaxe, I'm afraid. So I'm just going to get the, what I need right now, but I'm going to mark this area. mark this area because it's a good um <clears throat> that's a good supply of ore so but I'm not gonna get all of it because I'm going the wrong way because <laughs> there's a croc sitting right there it just totally missed me must be sleeping I'm okay with that I'm okay with that And as far as food, we could cook up what meat we have to take. Um, like I said, it, it may be a short run because we may just run out of weapons and pickaxes and everything else really quick. Or we might just die because, you know, I do that a lot in the mines. <laughs> I totally do that a lot in the mines. Let's just make sure our mines did get built. I'm pretty sure it did. If I remember in the last episode, we, I believe, got all the materials in it. No. It's, it will be here tomorrow, though. It's just building right now, so that's cool. Okay, so let's smelt this down. those permit points uh, back up again. Um, let's cook up this meat and see if we have any other meat that we can cook. <clears throat> because we're definitely going to have to take some resources here. Be as prepared as we possibly can, right? Um, what did I need? Oh, the pickaxe. <clears throat> this one may take a little while. He's kind of big. <laughs> Just 
She's like, will you hurry up? Will you hurry up, please? Okay, maybe not. And let's see if we have anything else that we put in here that we don't know about. <clears throat> we could cook some bananas for energy. Oh, we got more meat we could cook too. Um, yeah, let's put some of this stuff away. Mangrove, let's see if we can make a bunch of those. When I go down to the mines and it's early on like this, I use a lot of mangrove torches. <laughs> um, totally use a lot of them. <clears throat> I'm not kidding. Especially because I don't have a miner's hat or anything. Um, so what we want to do is, is this our seeds? Yeah, I think what we want to do is we're going to leave. Um, we're not going to need our axes. Um, we can take one of those. I want to have inventory space as well. So... We're not gonna need our shovel that. Um, we'll leave that here. Okay, we're not gonna need all that. So, <clears throat> let's, um, let's put down, that down there and that down there and let's get this going. And uh, just trying to make some room in my inventory as well. I'm not trying to eat it, oh my gosh. Uh, mm, mm. Stop it. <clears throat> if I had bought the barbecue, this would go a lot faster. I'm just saying. Although I feel like the bananas aren't going, are, are going a little bit faster than like the meat would. back up there. So what we want to do is we want to have a good weapon down here, right? Um, we want to have the other weapon probably close by. <clears throat> we can make some more meat. We want to put our pickaxe over here. Whoops. Wherever. But tell me I'm too full. I'm just trying to cook. <clears throat> oh, I don't know if I have many keys. We need to look at that. Do I have any keys? Or I have 11 keys. That's not too bad. Um, in case we find some rooms, hopefully we'll be lucky and find a glider. I'm just trying to put it in there. Quit. Um... I really would like to find, if I could find a glider and a um, doggo collar, I'd be happy. If we could find a couple rubies at least for money, I'd be happy. Um, I'm usually terrible about finding rubies. <clears throat> As y'all have seen in my previous videos or live streams, <clears throat> I usually have Shannon or Gamer Mom or both come over and help me out, which is awesome. But it's not that we couldn't do it on a recording, but it is a little bit more difficult to do on a recording. I feel like the meat takes a lot longer. 
Now we do have a lot of bush limes, but they don't, unless they're cooked, they don't give you a ton of energy. Um, we're definitely going to put this down here. We'll put this up here in case we need it. Um, cooked crockle meat is a must. In fact, we're going to put the rest of our mango sticks in here. We'll give us a little bit more space. We want to put our keys down here. Um, whoop, not in there. <laughs> The bad thing about the pit is that you have to get really close to it still. So I would seriously rather have the grill than anything. So today's kind of preparing. This may be a little bit more of a, a longer video than normal just because my mine runs are usually take quite a bit. Now we're cooking me. All right. I'll keep taking those milestones. That's fine with me. The jackaroos ever like, what are you doing cooking that meat? You shouldn't be doing that. I mean, I just feel like the more meat we have, the better. Um, again, I wish I had like a miner's hat or something. We could have bought the torch for 6000 but I didn't really want to spend the money. And um, <clears throat> they don't last all day. I don't know if they work like um, the helmers hat, the helmet, um, the miner's hat. Um, if you take Spinifex, I don't, or, or rena, bleh, resin, I don't know if that works the same way with like the miner's hat. If you take resin with you, it keeps it charged. I don't know if it works that way for the torch. I doubt it because you're not really wearing it. It's kind of how I feel about it. I could be wrong, but I, 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 it, it would make sense to me that it would work the same way. So, yeah, I don't know. I mean, we got a pretty good size inventory up here, down here. Not, not the same. Um, I don't know how much we're going to be able to get. But we're going to do whatever we can do. And, you know, we'll just go from there. Get away from my meat, bird. I'm seeing you over there. Oh, look at that beautiful sun setting. Isn't that beautiful in the red sky? It's beautiful. So we're in summer. We're towards the end, which means we're getting ready for autumn. You know, every day is a, is a step closer to spring, which is going to be beautiful. And, yeah, we've got... We've got the band stand up, we've got the museum up. We're getting close on Clover, very close on Clover. She may be the next one to move in. But I think we're close on Franklin too, if I remember right. Um, like if we look at our people, yeah, I think Franklin only has to be a heart. I think she only has to be a heart and it's just buying stuff. We might be close on two people, so that's good. Um, our town is just really getting started. <clears throat> Am I nervous about tomorrow going in the mines? Yes. When you're this underskilled, it's scary. It's scarier. <laughs> For sure. But I really, I need stuff. You know, there's stuff I need, there's stuff I want. I don't know if I want to take all night cooking all this meat. If I had the barbecue, I know, I know, I could have gotten it. I could have gotten it. But I'd rather try to get Clover here. So I had to kind of spend my money on that. I had to get the mine pass. Without the mine pass, there's no going into the mines. So... We had to do what we had to do. Okay, we're getting closer. We don't have that much more meat left to get, to do. Not to get, to do. Now the stars are coming out. It's a beautiful night. 
Isn't it pretty? It's just so pretty. Oh my gosh, I just am so amazed every time I play this game um, that one person did all this. One person did all this, you guys. Like, and it, he's probably worked on it. I don't know how long he's worked on it before he, for, he first put it out in early access last year. It was like last summer, so it's getting close to a, uh, the first year out in uh, early access. But I can't imagine how long it took him to even get it to this point, right? Even before, even before the first up, the first big update, even before that, when the game first came out, it was nearly flawless. Like, yeah, there's little bugs here and there, but not major and not anything that he can't fix pretty quickly normally. So it's the most well done game. Um, as far as I've seen, other than the big things like Nintendo and stuff, for but I'm talking about a one-man developer. That and Stardew Valley with Concerned Ape. Um, both of those, both of them are absolutely amazing. I can't speak well of Hoko Life, even though there was one developer. I, he did an amazing job, please don't get me wrong, because I love Hoko Life. But I feel like his games go out with a lot more bugs than what they should not to say it wasn't I did not get to play it when it first came out in early access so I was about maybe a year behind when I was able to finally start playing it so I can't speak to when it first came out and I won't even try will you go in there Sheesh. um so it's, it wouldn't be fair for me to even judge that I'm judging it from when I started playing it which was almost a year ago some of it is not his fault as far as, like, the stuff that came out on, like, console. That's totally not his fault. Um, <clears throat> but was the game flawless um, from the beginning? I Like I said, I don't know. Was it flawless when I started playing it? For the most part, yeah, but not like this. Not not quite like this. Okay, I think we're right good then. Um, I'm going to say pretty dang close. Pretty dang close. 100%? No. No, I don't feel like it was. But it was very well polished. I will say that. So I apologize for the length of the video, but I really would like to get down the mines and see what we can get. And I hope we can do a good job. I'm hoping beyond hope um, that it won't be a bad run. Um, <clears throat> I feel like, um, yep, our mind is built. So, yay! Okay, I think I'm going to move, um, this and that around. Okay, here we go, you guys. Wish me luck. Cross your fingers and toes. Um, let's go in my favorite mode, which is builder's mode. We're going to mark our spot real quick. I don't see any rooms right off the bat. So we're just going to start looking around. We're going to do a lot of running. Um, there's the bat shrine already. I'm not anywhere near being able to get that. We're looking for rubies. We're looking for rooms. Can't go that way. No, no, no. Um, if we can find rubies, oh, yeah, I'm totally going the wrong way now. Okay, let's go this way again. If we can find rubies, well, we're kind of blocked there. That's part of the problem. So let's just kind of go around. We'll go through this way. Um, if I can find some rubies, that would be awesome. Um, that is one of my goals today is to find a ruby or two, if at all possible. If I can find one, I'll feel lucky. Oh, I was going to hit him with my...
If you can get on a big rock in here, that's what you need to do. All right, that was a good start. Um, all right, let's continue to go this way. If we can find some rooms, if I can find a glider, I will I, I will love you forever. If I can find a glider. Oh, cool. Free stack. I'll take that. go around this way a little bit. I may have to get these bats. Turkey. No bat wings. That's what's so hard about getting the bat glider, you guys. Um, is the fact that it takes forever to, um, and you guys, if you play back this recording and see a ruby when I walk back, don't tell me. <laughs> Do me a favor, just don't tell me. Ow! Stop that. Um. No, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, it's hard to get the backlighter because the, the drop rate on, um, the, getting the bat wings is horrible. Like it seriously takes forever. Okay, we found a room. Um, we need to find the entrance. Yeah, not one, not one wing. Not one wing. Let's see where the entrance is. It's way over there. Okay. I should have brought my um, bug net. Can I get over there this way? Um, no, it's over the other way. The thing for me is to not have to um, go through, try to break through a lot of these because um, I just have the copper pickaxe, you know? There's the door. And yes, they follow you in the room now. So you have to. You have to do that. <laughs> we found a glider. Yes. That's amazing. Oh, we got a bat wing. Okay. All right. Um, that's awesome sauce. So what I like to do is mark the rooms. Um, let's just see if we can see um, a room anywhere on here. And I just really can't. So we're just going to go out and keep going down. Um, if That is, if I can figure out which way down is. No, that's going the wrong way. We can get that. So I guess we want to go down this way still. Come on, rubies. I'm a little bit more comfortable in the mines than I used to be. But like I said, it's just a lot more difficult um, when you go down with meager tools, meager weapons. Um, it's just a little bit more intimidating, you know? 
but but we're doing all right. We're we're hanging in there right now so far. Nobody's leaving any bat wings. Y'all are mean. Y'all are mean. Stop it. So I'm gonna kind of look back this way a little bit. <clears throat> no, thank you. I can't even see him. Ouch. Got me that time. Oh, put me on fire that time. Oh. Okay, that wasn't good. Somebody's over there fighting. I guess we better just keep going. Just keep going, just keep going. Yeah, the next time we'll bring our bug net and we'll bring our um, fishing rod. I'm just going to kind of look around this way a little bit. I'm not seeing a lot over here. Sometimes those rubies hide in the weirdest places. Um, I can't believe I got a glider, you guys. I'm so happy. Yeah, we're kind of getting stuck there. It's all right. We'll go around this way. I'm trying to see if I can find another room. Oh, I could get a lot of iron ore and stuff here, but you guys, I just, that's not my purpose this time. It's our first mine run um, on this island, so I'm just really getting stuck here. Oh, another bat wing. I just want to kind of cut through here this time. And that just led me to a dead end. So that wasn't even worth it. Okay. Well, you know, that is what it is. Can I go this way? No, I can't even go that way. All right, fine. Fine, 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 fine. We won't go that way. <laughs> Talked me out of it. So now I finally feel like I'm kind of turned around. Oh, I, I want to go back this way, I think. Yeah, I want to go back this way. See, I think I see a room over there. Oh my gosh, I'll leave me alone. <clears throat> Might not be a room. No, it's one of our another one of those light things. Is there a room on the other side? That's what I can't figure out. No. Oh, don't waste. No wasting.
Hmm. Gosh darn it. Stop. Hmm. Well, I haven't seen one ruby. I haven't been looking real hard. I've been kind of trying to pay attention to the the map a little bit and see if I can find rooms. So, if I'm missing the rubies, it's totally my fault. Oh, this is totally a dead end. Thanks for going that way. <clears throat> Another bat shrine. Oh, y'all like the bat shrine there? No, y'all didn't leave me nothing there. Um. No, not even one more. Y'all are mean. Can I even get through over here? I can't. We'll just go this way. Come on, rooms. Where are you? There's one. Looks like the entrances are on the other side. Where I'm going to have to probably cut through. Um, I might... It might be better if I went this way. Let's try. Maybe not. I feel like either way I go, I'm going to have... Yeah, we might be able to go around this way. And go... Um... Oh, no. This is like totally... Okay, let's see if we can go around this way. <clears throat> Let's see if we can get through it to it if we kind of go around this way. Oi. May or may not be a better choice. Let's see. Um, yeah, it's going to be a better choice, but. Oh, it's right there. Oh, that's a good pickaxe. Okay. So we'll mark this room. And uh, let's see, how do we want to go from here? Um, I kind of feeling like we still want to go this way. Yeah. <clears throat> Not having the luck on the rubies. Whoa! Excuse me. Pardon me, lady with the baby. Um... Oh no. We're gonna go back. <laughs> and we're gonna see if we can go around this monstrosity here. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. It is more intimidating when you're by yourself than with a player, another player. But it's also a little bit, oh, man, we're out of room there. 
I mean, we can't get through there. That's what I meant. Um, but it's also very satisfying if you can get, if you can accomplish some stuff. Man, there's a lot of roadblocks. Okay, I've already been that way, so we're going to go back this way. Oh, we found another room. Awesome. Um, trying to find where the opening is. I think it's up this way. <clears throat> no, it's right there. I think we're going to have to get, kill some bats first, so they're just going to follow us in there. I got a bat wing. Awesome. Oh, it's dark. It means it's a ruby room, you guys. Um, yeah, we definitely want this. We're going to head back and take this back to the shaft. We definitely could use the money for sure. Um, I wonder if I go this way. Where am I? Um, now I kind of need to go this way, I think. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me and my voice. Whoop. Whoop. If we're lucky, we'll be able to find some of our lights um, to help guide us back. Um, we'll see how well that works. Because we're definitely going to, for one thing, we're definitely going to have bats following us. Yeah, we're going to have to go the long way around. Uh, man, there's a lot of dead ends here. Okay. We're going to go around this way then. All right. Jump over the crocs. Jump, jump, jump. Well, we found a ruby, you guys. That was exciting. It was easier because there was a ruby room. Not going to lie. So, for those that are starting out for the first time, um, the ruby rooms are kind of cool, right? Because it's easier than trying to find one. I don't even know if I'm going the right way, you guys. Ugh, there's a lot of those in this one. Man. I'm trying to go around Joe. I feel like we're going the wrong way. If you get on a rock, the bats can't get you. No, we're actually going the right way, I think. Yeah, because it's up at the top. So we need to go this way, I think. No. We need to go this way. Oh, I cannot see over here, you guys. Oh, here we go. Here we go. afraid I was going to get trapped like that because I can't see because it's dark. Will you let me go around this way? Oh good, y'all just keep on fighting. I'm good with that. Oh my gosh, it may take me 10 years just to get the ruby back. I'm not even kidding. I feel like maybe we're getting close. Maybe. Oh, if I go in the water, it's just going to swim faster than me. <clears throat> Yay, we made it. We made it back. Guys, we got a ruby. <clears throat> now I think what we're going to do is go the opposite direction, maybe. 
Um, it's six o'clock, so do we don't have like a ton of time. Um, so yeah, we just kind of need to go up from here, I think. Jeez, will you quit following me? Seriously. <laughs> oh no, it's a dead end! Oh, they swim so much faster than me. Hurry, quit. Go, go, girl. Go, girl. Go, girl. Go, girl. Oh. Okay, that was a little nerve-wracking. We found a room. Um, Looks like it's over here. Oh, of course there's bats. You don't want to come? Okay. It's another ruby room, and we're so close. Guys, we're so close that this will be good to take back to the shaft very easily. So we've got two rubies. Let's put this down so we can see what the heck we're doing. Boy, the entrance is really buried in the rock, for sure. Okay, so <clears throat> for me in this game, this is perfect because we need money. Can I get her back around here? Um, we need money really bad. So for me, this is good because this is going to help a lot with our money situation. Oh, I got to try to get back. Oi. That might be not be fun. Maybe we can go this way. Yeah, we can go this way. Whoo. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't very far. You guys, that was amazing. Um, yeah, okay, so let's see where we want to go. We've got, we've still got a little bit of time. Um, we forgot to mark this. So yeah, I think we still kind of want to go this way. Oh, we can't go that way. How did I go there before? Yeah, let's still kind of go back this way. And, um, wow. Okay. Let's see if I can kind of get through. Oh, man. I cannot, uh, 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 I cannot, bleh. I cannot figure out how and why, the, oh no, why there is so many roadblocks in this one. It's like, okay, there's where our room was. So if we could keep going up from there. Roadblock, 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 okay. So we'll just go from there. But you guys, we've gotten two rubies. We got our glider, which I'm so excited about. So, so excited about that. It's hard to see where you're going and to get away from people attacking you or not people. Animals attacking you and trying to watch your mini map. Just saying. Not two. Not two. Mm. If we could find another room, it's eight o'clock, so we're, we don't want to go too far because it's eight o'clock. But if I could find one more room, I'd be happy at this point. We'll see if we'll be if we can be that lucky, or if we can even get through anywhere. Let's see if I can see the tip of a room anywhere. Not really. Mm -mm.
We've got fighting going on over there. I just found a ruby. Oh, there's two of them? Well, that ought to be fun. Okay, we may call this a mine run and be done just because we have got to get out of here by midnight and it's 918 it's gonna take us a while to get back and dodge everything in the dark that we have to dodge and um, that'll give us three rubies and we got a glider I'm happy I'm so happy about the glider I can't even tell you Like, where's my life? Oh, let's get our bearings. Um, are we going in even the right way? We need to kind of go like that, maybe. Yeah, we need to go like that. All right, let's try it. If we don't get stuck, maybe if I get a head start, I can get over to the ledge before he does. We want to go this way. Hmm. See, this is why I think we need to go back. <laughs> because I get stuck so easily in places trying to find the shaft. Uh, I feel like we're, we're, oh, there's the fish that we want to catch too. And of course I did not bring my fishing rod. go that way okay follow the lights now that's the room we were in um oh that was a bad move maybe there's the shaft you guys i think that was good for a good for a first time mine run with inadequate tools <laughs> and weapons i think we did pretty dang good guys i'm pretty proud and we didn't die and we didn't die and we made it out by before midnight three rubies too you guys i'm pretty proud of that i'm pretty darn proud of that i'm just saying So we'll be able to cash those these rubies in tomorrow and make some good money. And we got a glider. And I am so excited we got a glider. I can feel better now that I can glide around. Totally worth the run. Totally worth the 25 dinks. 25,000 dinks. Um, I feel like we did really well. Got three bat wings. That was pretty good. I think I'm going to put the bat wings in here.
Um, whoop. We got some paint. We got pink paint. That's not bad. Um, and we got a couple of sacks, too. That we didn't even have to work for. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and put the paint in here for now. And the extra chest. Um, we can sell some of that. We can sell this um, tomorrow as well. I think we'll put the keys in here, too, for safekeeping. Yeah, we could have only gotten in one more room. So, yeah, I think we did. Uh, I'm just going to stand right here. That would make a good thumbnail, right? You guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you watched it to the end and see it, saw how well I did in the mines this time. Pretty proud. Pretty proud. So, until next time, take care and stay safe. Hit that like button. Show the video some loving. And I'll see you soon.